Hustlers, hey, hey, welcome back to the channel. So I'm here with another video. Today's video is brought to you by samsbeauty.com. Thank you guys so much for watching today. I um, have this unit by Altre and it is their Melted Hairline Wig Divine in the color DR2 Cinnamon Wine. So this is what um, it will look like. This is not the color that I have, but this is a really, really pretty color she has it in the drff ginger mahogany um but again i have it in the dr cinnamon wine dr2 cinnamon wine so here's what it looks like really really rich velvety red velvet color like it just makes me want to slice a cake honey because this is nice i love it and definitely reminds me of red velvet cake for some reason um now i went ahead and already sprayed in some of my ebon um lace tint and this is in the uh, shade medium brown i like to go a little bit darker because i like it to blend in with my contour shade rather than my actual um skin tone so what i'm gonna do is go ahead and put this baby on and i actually need to blend out my makeup a little bit better right around here okay <laughs> I've been working all day so the makeup is kind of different but um I love how this wig has really soft lace um it does come with two combs in the front a comb in the back with adjustable straps and it also comes with an elastic band in it um the elastic band for me is just unnecessary only because it doesn't ever fit my head so but people with normal size to larger heads you probably will like it and it probably will fit you so what I'm gonna do is go ahead and clip back the hair and um i got a few um comments to do like a talk through so you guys know i usually um just go ahead and play some music while i am installing the wig because i'm not even the best at explaining things so for me i don't know if this is going to even be helpful But this is what the hairline is looking like really nice um it's not bad at all um i don't know exactly where my tweezers are and i don't feel like going to the hair store to get any right now so i'm going to go ahead and wing it with this particular wig and what i'm going to do now is go ahead and just cut the lace where my natural ears um are and we are going to go ahead and size up this wig so this is how it's looking on this side and it goes behind my ear perfectly so that's what you want um i want to do the same thing to the other side and don't be afraid to cut into the hair sometimes you might cut into the actual like lace portion of the hair and some people are just like i don't want to do that um it causes shedding but it's better to have a little bit of shedding um over your wig like sitting over your ears and just being really uncomfortable so this is what this is looking like um and this is a left side part so you guys who are left side part girls um will like this unit so what I like to do, I'm going to go in and go ahead and cut the lace off. It does come with baby hairs that you can finesse to your liking or just kind of comb them in to the actual hairline if, you, you know, baby hairs is not your thing. So I like to do just little snips um, because it kind of creates that um, rigid effect that uh, we all like when we're installing our wigs. So that's what I did to that side. In this side, I will do the exact same thing. So just small snips. Snip, snip, snip. Um, how have y'all been? Like, I've been really good. I've been loving my new job. So things have just been great. And I'm grateful to God for it because... 
I was getting extremely burnt out from the job that I had prior. I've always worked with kids, but now I'm working with high schoolers, so it's completely different. But um, it really has been a joy, honestly. So what I'm going to do lately, I haven't even really been tacking down the middle. Um, I think I will today, though. I'm going to go ahead and just, I usually always go in with my got to be free spray this is my best friend um and i'm not going to use anything else until this one goes away <laughs> basically or you know i run out um so i will try other sprays of course like the bedhead and others that you guys have recommended but um i did use before this um i used this was always the first thing that i used but i went in with the um the got to be glam for spray as well i used that before too so that worked as well and i liked it so i'm gonna go in and just spray this or i did it <laughs> spray it out already so i'm gonna go in and just blow dry it So now I'm going to go in and just take the tail end of my comb and just take out the very front portion of the hairline. And I like to go in and just spray this area. And you don't necessarily have to make all of these baby hairs because I usually don't. But I like to go in with this section and just spray it down. And you already can kind of tell how natural it's looking already. Um, Altair really has done obviously a really good job with these wigs. Like I am been super duper duper impressed. Um, I really didn't think of a question of the day for this particular video because I knew I was going to be talking a lot and I really didn't even think about it to be quite honest with y'all but um I'm sure I'll think of one throughout this video. Oh, what is your um let's what is your go-to song right now? Um uh, right now mine is that song that they play on the radio quite a bit. Um it gets on um uh, everybody else's nerves right about now, but I still love it. It is that um that Jeremiah and Neo song. Only want you to love. I don't want nobody else. That song, I love it. But yes, that is my favorite song right about now. Um, I've just been loving it. So, And I love that they, you know, obviously got permission to use computer love. Um, you guys know I'm old. I got an old soul. So you guys know I love the original computer love. So um, it was a nice little take and for me like i feel like most of the time you know it doesn't compare to the original but at the end of the day you know times are changing we still have to make new music and we can still pay homage to older music um but make it more modern and you know to where you know younger people want to listen to Okay, so what I'm going to do now is just take my edges wrap and I'm going to go in and just tie this all down. Tie it down, tie it down. So while this is pretty much setting and melting, 
I'm going to go ahead and watch an episode of Judge Mathis and I'll be right back. You want to set this for at least like maybe, you know, 10, 15 minutes and yeah, you should be good. So I'm going to go ahead and like I said, watch an episode of Judge Mathis and I'll be right back. Okay, so now I'm going to go in and just take this off and as you can see, it's pretty melted. So... Whatever hair I'm not going to use for baby hair, I'll go ahead and just, um, and I think I'm going to just use this little bit here. And then um, I'm going to cut these down a little bit shorter. And just use a little bit over here. I have found that the only thing that works for my baby hairs on synthetic wigs is the got to be gel. Um, whether you use the um, the one that the yellow bottle or this one here, it really doesn't matter. Both of them work. They're very strong gels. Um, for me, like trying to use like mousse or anything like that just does not work for me anyway. Um, you definitely can try it on your own and you know form your own opinion. But for me, um, it just does not work. So I think I'm going to go ahead and put those back. Um, I've been liking like the really subtle kind of baby hairs lately. Um, I still like my little swoops, don't get me wrong. Um, but I just don't like them everywhere now. So I'm going to go ahead and put these back. This back here. And then I'm going to go ahead and do the sideburns. And um, be very sparing when it comes to this particular gel. Um, only be Especially if you have your makeup on already. It really is better to do it while you don't have any makeup on. So you don't have to worry about any foundation or anything um, at all. But if you are in a rush like me um then you just gotta do what you gotta do okay so i'm gonna take my eyebrow razor oh shoot i'm gonna take my eyebrow razor and just create me a little sideburn action and take a little bit of the gel Just swoop it to your liking. Um, and for those of you who don't care for baby hairs, um, you know, you skip a whole step. So, you'll be pretty much done with your wig by, by now. We over here still swooping. <laughs> but, those of us who like baby hairs, you know, it's worth it to us. Because, child, I love me some baby hairs. Um, and I was like doing my baby hairs in like high school when people weren't really doing them anymore. And it was like, people was looking at me like, girl, who you trying to be chilly? And then here come, here y'all come years later doing the exact thing I was doing. You feel me? But it's cool. It's cool. I knew what I was doing. I knew what I was on. I knew what I was on too. But yeah, right now I feel like that's the only song, current songs that I really, really like. I've been liking Pop Smoke too. You guys know I ain't really like a rap, a like current rap listener. But I do like Pop Smoke a lot as far as. But he definitely gives me, and let me know if y'all think the same. He definitely gives me uh, Lloyd Banks vibes. Like his voice and his whole like... um Person, not really persona, but like the way he sounds. His sound is definitely Lloyd Banks ish, especially in certain songs. I just be like, whoa, who is that? <laughs> Sound like Lloyd Banks to me. Um, but these little young kids now don't know nothing about no Lloyd Banks. I'm just adding my um powder to the parting area, and this parting space goes back so far. I really, really 
enjoy this parting space. So I have my hot comb on. And sometimes if you just get like um just a really light spray, just just like that. And like just go really quick in there. And it kind of gives you that height that we all love in our bank area. And I get a lot of questions about if I'm going to do wig sales. I may make a whole video about this, but I have a lot of opinions on wig sales. Um, and, you know, people trying to scam and all of that type of stuff. I just... I just don't play that and I just would rather not come out of character for people um, that are trying to scam me. You know what I'm saying? I just, I would rather <laughs> just not deal with it. And um, I donate a lot of my wigs to homeless shelters, women's homeless shelters, so that those women can look good going to job interviews and things of that nature. So I just feel like... And I do a lot of manipulation to my wigs as well. Like, as you can see, I'm doing quite a bit to this wig. And I just don't feel comfortable doing all of this manipulation to a wig and then selling it. So, because this wig is manipulated to my liking. I'm not sure if nobody else will like what I'm doing to a wig. So, I would rather just play safe and just... um keep it for myself or give it to someone less fortunate than me but omg this is a really really cute wig i love the style of it really cute and as you can see the outcome came out really really good i didn't even have to pluck or nothing yes it would look better if i did but you don't have to if that's not your judge if that's not your stilo you don't have to pluck so Here's the length, and this is the perfect length. Like, if all of my synthetic wigs could be this length, that's what I would prefer. I love this color. Shout out to Sam's Beauty for mainly always having um, their, the colors in stock. Um, I ain't gonna mention no names, but honey, they always be having the colors, and I'll be irritated. But... Honey, this this wig is really really pretty. I like it a lot. Um, I really didn't even have to use my um hot comb because it came out of the box really um flat. I love the bang area. It's just enough zhuzh and it's just enough layers for it to look really really pretty. Like look at that side profile view. Really gorgeous. <laughs> So y'all have to let me know what y'all feel about this one down below. I absolutely love it. Um, this is one that I would definitely wear to work. Really, really cute. I love it. So y'all have to let me know down below what y'all think. And I will see y'all in my next video. Stay pretty. Stay hustling. Give this video a thumbs up and all of that good stuff. And I will see y'all later. Deuces.